everyone, my name is Inbar. I'm a musician. I play a lot of instruments, and one of my favorites is the spoons hiding away in your kitchen. I'm going to teach you how to play, and I think this is going to take less than five minutes. Let me know if I'm right. So go grab a pair of matching spoons, and they can be little teaspoons or bigger spoons, just not very big ones. Whatever is comfortable for you, just have them be matching. First step to hold. Now, the first spoon is facing up, and I'm holding it between these two fingers. And this is important, it's touching my palm. It's not in the air. It's always touching my palm. Second spoon is facing down, and it's going between these two fingers. So I slide it in, and also important, it's touching my palm. Now, for the next step, we need to have a good space between the spoons. Now, this is too big. And this is non-existent. So what I do is I play around with the placement of this hand. See, I can slide it forward or back. Once I have a space, I test it out. I don't know if this is good or too small or too much. The basic test is to hit your leg. Great. Once you get a sound, let's start playing. First technique is this. I can use the whole spoon or just the tip. And then that way I have two different sounds and I can create rhythms. So play around with that. Next technique, taking this empty hand and placing it above my leg. So once I go up, I get a sound as well. So I'm doubling my rhythm now. You can practice speed, all right? Practice that. And now, for the coolest technique of all, I'm going to slide down my fingers this way, all right? And what I do for that is I stretch my fingers and I play, first of all, I test it, and I play every finger individually. If I got a sound, I can slide down, land on my leg. If I wasn't getting a sound, then something is wrong with my hold. So I fix that, got a sound, slide. And I can slide fast, I can slide slow. I like the slow better, but play around. Now you can combine all of these techniques and also make it visually stimulating and visually interesting. Use your whole body. Use your palm as well for playing. So play with that. Use your chest, use your other leg, use your mouth. All right, so. Let me know how this went. Let me know if you have any questions. Don't be shy, please. Send me videos of you playing and enjoy this marvelous instrument called the spoons.